Right then, my dudes. Today, we are having a late afternoon walk, which I don't normally do. But I thought this would be a cool time of day. That guy's cutting there a bit, wasn't he? They cut here like mad lit. Cut right in, see, on the corner, if you're standing on it. So guys, welcome back to the channel. Touching down from Chiang Mai City in Northern Thailand. You know the drill. And today we're gonna take a walk down a cool little street that I wanna show and it's nice and quiet and there's a lot of stuff to see down here and we can have a chat along the way. We got the um, the Arsh Boutique Hotel just over here and we got all the condos here, the pink condos and if you come up to the corner here, there's this little road here. So this is the one we're gonna take a walk down. Today we're gonna talk about probably a few things as we go around but the dreaded new visas and everybody's on about the visas. Looks like we've got an house here to rent as well, look. Wouldn't be bad, would it? Wouldn't be bad. Look at Arkin Estate of that, look. Look at that. Little on the wave. What a right state that is. <laughs> yeah, this is for rent, look. The visas on everybody's lips, man. I've been reading about it all day today. So basically, both the DTV and the new 60 day exemption are in effect now right but as as you know with thailand even though it's out and they're both active they're both as clear as mud right there's still people arguing online and this is the rules then no 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 so yeah the 60 days in effect right and people are doing that and you can extend that by another 30 days so three months but what everybody's on about now online is people are saying that this is unlimited. You can keep doing unlimited border bounces. And yeah, I can't see that happening, can you? But there's a lot of top guys that run the groups swearing by that. This, it's going to be unlimited land borders from now on. There isn't no limit apparently on flying in now right on visa exempts you could there's going to be a point when you would be stopped i think but now people are saying you can do unlimited land borders runs visa runs visa exempt runs what would that do to all the other visas that's what i'm trying to think you know that's it's just everybody's going to do that and it's going to be carnage, right? Who's going to go on to a tourist visa or an education or anything when you can just do as many border bounces as you want? But that's not going to happen. And I know a lot of people on these forums are swearing by it. it's happening and they're putting up proof as well. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens about that, right? I, don't, I think Thailand have just messed it up like they normally do and they will put it right as time goes i think because how can you have unlimited border runs and and different it's going to be carnage here isn't it these dogs chained up yeah they chained up damn man they look they look hungry he's chained up Woo. <laughs> my old ticker see this guy just lives like this look Lives on the side. He's got his dogs, look. No one's messing with him, are they? Yeah, he just lives. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that, then. This is the sunny days, look. Back in the early days, I've done a vlog here. It's called a different name now. This lady's out cleaning. Lots of Franks stay here. Little apartments, look. Little, little small apartments. There was about 7,000 a month back in covid times if i can find the vlog i will leave it linked below brett devon that used to do vlogs here and everything it's um it's a quiet place but a lot of people say they have parties over here a lot so it's called sunny days now look so i went to look in here as well this one is owned by um muslim muslim family own own this place here it was a little bit 
little bit old man but again i love i love this road see it goes way back there i went to look at a room down here so yeah let me know what you guys think on the entry i mean it is 60 days that is happening right i think we can it's fair to say we know that that's happening because loads of people have shown their stamps and even vloggers have been out and back in and got 60 days but how many can you do is it gonna be unlimited nah i don't think so man i i could be wrong i'm hope i'm wrong because um yeah we'll just all go on to that right yeah i don't mind i'll move to chang rai like i said and just do go to my side all the time in the future instead of getting a retirement but that's that's not going to be the case and the dtv visa i've done a vlog saying it's not probably what it seems to be and even that's not not clear yet it's it's as clear as mud but it looks like it is going to be a little bit more difficult so in here guys this is absolute paradise spa it's a little hidden away body to body massage and um you see guys kind of there's probably a few westerners in here now old left building look i think it used to be a hotel and look they've even made the pool into a pond <laughs> and if you go on level two the girls the girls are up here waiting for you um i think it's two thousand baht for a body to body massage i've been in here <laughs> yes i went to have a look when she said two thousand i came straight out again um if you go to floor two look floor two the girl will be waiting there at reception um it's all sort of professional and stuff and the girls the girls will be standing in the door like and you can choose one i think and yeah too fat it was a little bit expensive for me i went in there i was gonna have one done but it's a yeah somebody my friend was telling me it's quite a raunchy one you know you'll probably maybe get extras i'm not saying you will but it's a body to body massage place and yeah i watched this place getting built this is brand new guys this place they've just built this it's just finished in the last few weeks so yeah another place here look right so the dtv the digital nomad digital tourist visa the the info's all out they've got it all up on the sites and um yeah i've got it here It'd be too small to put up on the screen so it says it's ten thousand baht right for five years and what people are saying about this also is after your 180 days you can extend it for another 180 days like you would be going for an extension but i don't believe that either but we're gonna have to wait and see what that's like there's the there's the sky walk place look it's massive isn't it this is from the other side it looks like everyone's full as well doesn't it and you got the massive pool on top yeah it's, it's different from when we went in there and done a review there you go looks like it's awful man and here you got the chiang mai memorial hospital so i never like riding past this one here then they've just cleared this spot here this is going to be a brand new it's either going to be a hospital with the hospital here or another brand new apartment block i'm going for a brand new apartment block that's what i'm going for i don't know about you guys so yeah they're just starting look cleared this space probably gonna be more apartments that's what i would say anyway it's, it's prime time in it it's down near chang clan on the night night bazaar street there so i could have just come here look it's all over they ain't got no hey, it's gonna be hop in that's what it's going to be. Oh, it's going to be Hop In Hotel. They're building Hop Inlet. So that's what it's going to be. Brand new Hop In. Hello, hello. Hey, sweaty cab. <laughs> yeah, going to be the hotel. Right next to this one. 
So this is the Lana Palace right in the Chang Clan area and that's going to be the new Hop Inlet and that there is Astra Skywalk where if you walk down there you're at the front of Astra Skywalk hey hey Bobby Dazzler mate hey let's have a look at this digital tourist visa then so on the main site it says you need a passport or travel document easy right photograph document indicating current location so what would that be just where you live or maybe a utility bill i don't know financial evidence amounting of no less than 500 baht so yeah i've seen online that one guy's done it by just showing money in his PayPal, paypal account or something so the tricky bit for me which is probably why i don't think i would go for this is you need proper employment papers by the sounds of it work workation employment contract or employment certificate outside of thailand or professional portfolio showcasing digital nomad remote worker or foreign talent freelance status so it's still clear as mud on this as well right right so what else do you need activities proof of confirmation to attend the activity or letter of appointment from hospital medical center so you can get this visa by coming here for medical treatment by the sounds of it as well uh marriage i think you uh, yeah there's a so one guy i can't put it up on screens it'll be too small but i've uh, i've took a screenshot of one guy that's done this visa in padang malaysia and he needed an official an official stamp from his workplace so yeah that's that's not going to be easy for anyone is it if you're a digital nomad i mean could you I know before you could get around these things with the old multi-entry because I'd done the multi-entry and I had to show a letter from my workplace and it was quite easy man I just um, printed one up and took it into my boss to to sign it so yeah is that going to be the case with this one I mean 500,000 baht not everybody's got that either have they but yeah that would be no problem for me but yeah this is the chicken place my mate jeff used to always love this place here so they're getting ready for tonight swaddy cap sabadi mai so yeah later on they will have loads man she will have loads on there but it's still a little bit early see you see you again <laughs> hello <laughs> friendly look you see how much it's been raining cats and dogs mate cats and dogs so this lady got the potato banana chips got the banana oh, i love these aroy i get addicted to them but they're not good for you man not good for me <laughs> full of salt so yeah yeah the vloggers wandered off a lot but that's what it's all about man if you want factual don't come the youtubers won't get factual on here mate nobody's got factual man even though these visas are active now that's thailand all over isn't it people still you still don't know it's different people are still getting different um reactions from immigration at different places so yeah the only way i think we will know how things are panning out is over time don't you when a lot of people have done it and we see what the um, big bike tours never seen this one hey never seen big bike tours man I've heard about it but never seen it they got some biggins in they got some biggins in there mate right so we're walking back around now guys I'm testing my new battery actually I bought some third party batteries for the camera and it seems like they're holding up quite well even though there's official official rules out it's still up in the air isn't it 
No sod nose still. <laughs> no sod nose man. It's all pot luck at what officer you get, I think, still and I mean I really let's cross over here man. So now we're doing the rounds again. I can't see unlimited visa exempts on land borders, can you? Can you see that happening? I mean, if they done that, they are... I mean, they could do it if they're desperate for people, I suppose. But why... Why do that? You're going to have to scrap all the other visas, right? I just can't see how it's going to work out. Got the bike shop there. Always like this place, 20 baht washing outside. They've given it a lick of paint as well. What's it called? Smile Residence. So we are right downtown nearly, guys. Downtown, if you take this road, you're going into Night Bazaar. Yeah, they've done this place up a treat. So we're going to keep walking down. Yeah, I'm enjoying this late afternoon walking out this is what i'm gonna do more and more now so what i do want to know is people on my channel have you come in on any of these visas or have you applied because i think you have to apply for the dtv out of the country right i'm not 100 on none of this but i'm sure it's like the old visas where you have to do it in your own country or somewhere else right i don't think it's possible inside thailand i hope it is and maybe that will change. Woo, smashing this walk out, man. I'm nearly back to Lucille, mate. That, it just feels so quick when you've got the camera. I probably would be a mess by now without, without the camera. So in here you've got the pregnancy, the um, health hospital, maternity, whatever you want to call it. Right on the corner here. Yeah, always like this area, man. Always like it. But the roads, this little, um, this little zigzag here is quite dodgy as well when you're going through on the bike. Because they cut, they cut the corner, see? They cut it like mad. If you're not being careful. Your little temple that never go in this one. Wak Wah Fai. Never really go in here. But you can um you can hear it they're always having do's and stuff in here ceremonies all right where's this guy going okay mate he's cutting down the tree look look no jeez man you see that i thought it hurt him it fell right on him mate He's wrapping a rope around it now. So they're doing a lot of this around the city. Getting rid of some of the dangerous, dangerous trees and stuff. You can get your rice and stuff here, man. Yeah, see, this is the way to buy it. If you want to live here really cheap and get your eggs as well. And your onions. You even got a chemist here. Never been in that one either. Hey, there she is. That's where we started. That's where we walked down there. Done the full rounds, mate. Done the full rounds. I'll just show you around here a minute where a lot of you will know now. So sometimes I get some stuff off this lady as well. What she got today mangoes, 40 baht, potatoes, apples. I might get some apples. See, there's the arsh and the owl man. So it's just a walk and a talk in, you know, not all about it. It'd be boring if I walked around in all, just a visa. We would have run out of visa topic quarter of the way around. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Do you think this is all legit? This visa and is it gonna be unlimited? No, I think it's gonna be two or three entries again, right? And then, then you're gonna be, Getting your, getting your hands slapped, maybe. So, I don't know. We shall see how it goes. <laughs> A lot of new farangs about me staring 
They cut this bit big time, mate. I'm gonna stop waffling and get home because I am sweating. Hope you're all safe and sound as always, guys. And yeah, we'll chat about something else in the next walk. Walking around then, gonna show some other places. So, hope you're all safe and sound as always. Not an angle grinder. We've got a um, chainsaw. Take it easy, man. Take it easy.